Well, hello, welcome back. I'm Katie Fortune and this is Motivation Moment. Yeah, a weekly video series where you get one video every Monday morning, hopefully to inspire, encourage, and maybe sometimes just laugh. Maybe you just need a little laugh. That's what I'm here for. This week I want to talk about failure. Ooh, failure. Yeah, something no one wants to talk about. I actually don't believe in the word failure. Yeah, it's kind of crazy now that I say it out loud. But why I don't is because, quite honestly, failure is a harsh word, right? I believe that you either win or you learn, okay? Now, I don't believe in participation awards. I do think that having sometimes in sports or different things, you're going to lose or you're not gonna win or you're gonna fail or whatever, but it doesn't have to be this terrible and hateful thing, right? It really doesn't. I feel like when people talk about failure, it's like, it's the worst thing ever. Oh, I failed, oh my gosh. And don't get me wrong, I've been there. I am one of the most competitive people you will ever meet. I'm really good at hiding it, but I am very competitive, but with myself. I don't compete with anyone else, I compete with myself. I want to do better than I did yesterday. That's me, okay? That's not everyone. But why I don't believe in the word failure is because it's, it is, it's just a heavy word. And I feel like when kids are like, I failed, I'll never be able to do it again. No, you learn. What did you learn when things didn't go your way? What did you learn when whatever you tried to do and you didn't win at it or you failed at it, what did you learn from that? I believe every single, every single thing in your life is a learning experience whether it went right or if it went wrong or not the way you planned it to go. That's just my opinion. But it has helped me in my life to think about it as a learning opportunity. I'm going to learn about what I don't wanna do again or maybe I do wanna do that because it did work, but this part over here didn't work. Or maybe I worked at a company that treated me like garbage and now I know how I am not going to treat other people. Or maybe someone bullied me and now I learned how I'm not gonna treat other people. It could be anything. Maybe I lost a volleyball game. It happened and I didn't like it. Yes, I was a big volleyball player in high school, but man, I don't like to lose at all. I believe that if you're going for something that you really dream and love and whatever that may look like, it may not work out exactly as you thought it did. There is going to be bumps in the roads. There are gonna be failures that you can take and learn from them. Don't take a failure and say, I'm done, not doing it anymore. I failed, I can't do it. No, that's where you're wrong. You can do it. Take what you've learned from that situation. Take what you've learned, tweak it, change it, and keep moving. So that's why I don't believe in the word failure. And I'm gonna keep doing this all day long because I really don't love the word. Because unfortunately, I have heard way too many times, oh, I didn't win, I failed at that. I'm never doing that again, that was uncomfortable. Are you kidding me? Keep going. Just because one bump, just because 10 bumps, and you didn't get what you wanted, doesn't mean you failed. It means you're learning. We are here to learn every single day. We are not here to stay mediocre and stay where we are. We need to learn every day. If you're not learning at least one thing every day, are you really living? Come on learn something and your failures or your losses or something that didn't work out as planned doesn't mean you need to quit. 
It doesn't. Take a step back and figure out what can I learn from this situation? And this can even go for conversations you have with people that you don't agree with. I'm having them every day. We all are. We know what time we're living in. You don't agree with everything everyone believes in. I don't agree with everything everyone believes in. Sometimes it gets real close to home who you don't agree with. And I try to step back and say, what can I learn from this? It's that simple. It's not easy. It's not easy to fail. Failing stinks. <laughs> Losing stinks. But if you can take something and learn from it, you are growing. I believe in you. Maybe just think of the word failure a little differently now. I do actually embrace it. If something doesn't go my way, I sit back and I look, what can I have done differently? And actually as a side note, even in sales, in sales, my day job, if I don't win a job, I ask them, what could I have done differently? Is there something that didn't go right for you? Because I need to learn this. I want to know so I don't do it again. All right. That was a whole lot of Katie today. So <laughs> I hope you have a great day. And don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel. Hit the notification bells and you will know every time I post a new video. And I'm going to be doing some really fun things here soon. Pretty excited about it. And I can't wait for you to see it as well. Have a wonderful day. And as always, less hate, let's go motivate. And I'll see you next week. I literally don't remember what I was going to say. Like, completely out of my head. <laughs>